Police footage from Garrison Brown's death scene leaked to the media, public is furious. New revelations surrounding the tragic demise of Garrison Brown, a prominent figure from the popular reality TV show Sister Wives, have recently emerged, shedding new light on the circumstances of his death. The release of body cam audio footage from Flagstaff PD officers has stirred a wave of emotions among fans and sparked further inquiry into Garrison's untimely passing. Despite the ongoing turmoil, Garrison's family persists in their efforts to navigate life in the wake of this profound loss. The audio recording captured the poignant moment when police officers entered Garrison's apartment, discovering him lifeless in his bedroom. Amidst the solemn atmosphere, a peculiar detail caught the attention of the responding officer, the firearm found on Garrison's lap was unloaded. This unsettling revelation hinted at the possibility that someone may have been present before the authorities arrived, adding a layer of complexity to the investigation. The emotional impact of Garrison's death reverberated through those closest to him, as evident in the heart-wrenching reactions captured in the audio. Cheyenne, one of Garrison's roommates, was overcome with grief upon learning the tragic news. The weight of the situation bore heavily on her, compounded by the realization that she may have heard the fatal gunshot the night before. In hindsight, Cheyenne lamented not checking on Garrison, particularly after he had confided in her about his struggles with alcohol. The burden of guilt weighed heavily on her shoulders, as she grappled with the what-ifs and the profound loss of her friend. In the aftermath of Garrison's passing, his family and loved ones continue to grapple with the profound void left by his absence. Each day presents a new challenge as they navigate through the grief and pain, seeking solace and healing amidst the turmoil. Memories of Garrison serve as both a source of comfort and anguish, a reminder of the vibrant spirit extinguished too soon. As the investigation into Garrison's death unfolds, questions linger and speculation mounts. The release of the body cam audio footage has ignited a flurry of discussions among fans and followers, each grappling with their own interpretation of the events leading up to that fateful moment. Amidst the speculation and uncertainty, one thing remains certain. The impact of Garrison's passing extends far beyond the confines of reality television, leaving an indelible mark on those who knew and loved him. In the midst of tragedy, there is a glimmer of hope, a reminder that even in the darkest of times, there is strength in unity and resilience in the face of adversity. As Garrison's loved ones continue to navigate the turbulent waters of grief, they find solace in each other, drawing strength from their shared memories and the enduring legacy of a life well lived. And though the pain may never fully dissipate, they take comfort in knowing that Garrison will forever live on in their hearts, a shining beacon of love and light in a world touched by darkness. The news of Garrison Brown's untimely death has sent shockwaves through both the Sister Wives community and the wider audience who followed the Brown family's journey. The heartbreaking revelation of his passing, conveyed to his roommates Addison and an unnamed individual over the phone, has left many in disbelief. Addison, grappling with the news, reflected on Garrison's battles with alcoholism and depression. Such struggles cast a somber light on the circumstances surrounding his death, leading Addison to speculate whether Garrison was under the influence on the tragic night. Garrison's passing has left a profound void in the lives of his loved ones, including his parents, Janelle and Cody, and his siblings. The pain of his absence reverberates through the family, as they navigate the profound grief that accompanies such a loss. In the wake of Garrison's passing, the outpouring of support from the Sister Wives community and fans of the show has been both heartfelt and overwhelming. Messages of condolence and solidarity flood social media platforms, offering a semblance of solace to the grieving Brown family during this trying time. However, amidst the expressions of sympathy, there exists a cloud of uncertainty fueled by the release of distressing audio recordings. Commenters, upon hearing the heartbreaking audio, voiced their outrage and demanded its removal, deeming it disrespectful and inappropriate given the circumstances. Moreover, questions regarding the actions of Garrison's roommates have emerged, prompting speculation and suspicion. Concerns about the roommates' response, or lack thereof, upon hearing the noise have led some to scrutinize their involvement in the events leading up to Garrison's death. 
The revelation that the gun was moved prior to the arrival of law enforcement further complicates the situation, casting doubt on the sequence of events and raising suspicions of foul play. Commenters, fueled by speculation and conjecture, have called for a thorough investigation, insinuating that someone may be held accountable for Garrison's tragic demise. As the Brown family mourns the loss of Garrison, they are confronted with not only the devastating reality of his passing but also the lingering questions surrounding the circumstances of his death. The need for closure and justice looms large as they navigate this tumultuous chapter in their lives. In the midst of sorrow and uncertainty, the Brown family finds solace in the outpouring of love and support from their extended community. Together, they lean on one another, drawing strength from their bonds as they navigate the complexities of grief and loss. While the investigation into Garrison's death continues, the Brown family remains steadfast in their commitment to honoring his memory and seeking the truth. As they grapple with the aftermath of this tragic loss, they cling to the hope that justice will prevail, bringing closure to a chapter marked by heartache and uncertainty. The untimely demise of Garrison has sent shockwaves through his community, leaving more questions than answers in its wake. Initially thought to be a suicide, the circumstances surrounding his death have deepened, raising suspicions and concerns among his family and friends. Adding a layer of complexity to the situation is the revelation that Garrison's roommate was, in fact, his own brother. This detail injects a poignant familial element into the tragedy, intensifying the grief felt by those closest to him. The dynamics of their relationship and the proximity in which they lived only served to heighten the mystery surrounding Garrison's passing. One perplexing aspect of the case is the discrepancy between the reported gunshot and the lack of immediate action from the roommates. Despite allegedly hearing the fatal shot, they failed to investigate, leaving many to wonder why they didn't rush to Garrison's aid. This omission raises suspicions and fuels speculation about what truly transpired in those fateful moments. Further complicating matters is the absence of a suicide note and the discovery of only one bullet. These details cast doubt on the initial assumption of suicide, prompting investigators and loved ones alike to question whether there may have been foul play involved. The lack of concrete evidence leaves a void of understanding, leaving Garrison's loved ones grappling with uncertainty and grief. Garrison's family, in particular, has been devastated by his passing. His brother Gabriel, who discovered his lifeless body, now faces the unimaginable pain of losing not only a brother but also a roommate and confidant. Their shared history and the emotional fallout from their father's actions add layers of complexity to their mourning process, deepening the sense of loss felt by all who knew Garrison. Reflecting on Garrison's journey, it's evident that he faced challenges within his family dynamic. A rift with his father, Cody, led to his departure from the family home, marking a significant chapter in his life. Cody's assertion that he had provided all that Garrison needed by the age of 21 underscores the strained relationship between father and son, hinting at unresolved tensions that may have contributed to Garrison's struggles.